Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey, what's up? My name is Caitlin, and this is a channel where I talk all things toys and dolls. Today we're doing another Monster High doll line ranking. We are doing Scaris. There are quite a few dolls in this line, so we are not going to dilly-dally, we're just going to dive right in. No surprise, Deuce gets last place. <laughs> I do like Deuce, I think he's cute, but at the end of the day he's wearing a tank top and shorts. I mean, I guess it has a hood at least, but... He's a boy doll. They usually fall lower. I'm sorry. I do really like these shorts though. I think they're fun. He has a bag, which is cool. His shoes aren't horrible. Nothing about this doll is bad. It's just not as detailed as the other ones because unfortunately that was a very common theme. But I do like him. I do like the shoes a lot. So he's good. Next up is Gulia. I hate her hair. <laughs> like, hate it a lot. I think her makeup's really pretty though, and I do like this dress. I'm not like blown away with it because it is pretty simple, but it's still kind of cute. I do like the purse and the shoes are okay. So overall, this doll's pretty just okay. I do like her. I don't dislike her by any means, but she's just kind of meh. 10th place goes to Katrine, and if you've seen this channel, you already know I'm not like super into Katrine. I think she has a really pretty face. I do not like her hair at all. And her outfit is just kind of okay. I like the skirt. I don't really care for the shirt. I like her purse. I don't really care for the shoes. So kind of similar to Gulia, she's very okay. There's a lot of things I do like about her. There's a lot of things I don't. But Katrina's never been one of my favorites, unfortunately. At least this particular Katrine. There's other Katrines that I love. But this one is a meh doll again. Next up is Draculaura. You guys know I hate putting Draculaura this low, but honestly like there's just so much more detail in the other dolls that she has to be this low I still think she's really pretty I do like her her outfit's cute it's just not like anything spectacular her face is beautiful as always I don't super love her hair but I never really love it when they do this to her hair and her shoes are pretty boring yeah <laughs> eighth place goes to Rochelle I like her. I think she's pretty. I love her outfit. At least the top. I love the top. The skirt is meh. I've never really been super into the Eiffel Tower thing. Like, I know that was, like, a trend for a while, especially when this was a thing. But it was never... I never really liked it. I think it was because my little sister was obsessed with it. <laughs> and it kind of just, like, was overdone in my household. But that's a personal thing, I guess. <laughs> but I do love her shoes. Her hat's cute. Her face is beautiful. And I love her top. I just don't really like her skirt, which is why she's this low. Because honestly, I'm nitpicking at this point. Seventh place goes to Abby. I think she's beautiful. I really love her hair like this. I love this dress. That's really, really cute. Purse is meh, but not bad. The belt is okay. And the shoes are okay. She's really cute, and I do like her. It's just, again, the other dolls are just better. This doll's not bad. The other dolls are just better. Next up is Cleo, who is beautiful. I'm not super obsessed with this lip color on her. I do think there's other lip colors that would have been better, but other than that, she's stunning. I love this dress. The scarf's really cute. The purse is cute. Shoes are cute. She looks really good. I always love a Cleo doll. Like, we already know this, but I think she's really pretty. It's just another case of the others are better. Oh, I'm obsessed with these shoes. Like, Cleo has great shoes. Like, she really does. In fifth place, I have Laguna, who is stunning. Honestly, her and Cleo are kind of interchangeable for me. I would have them either place and be fine with it. I love her hair. I love her lip color. I love this dress. The purse is really cute. I like her shoes. I just love this doll. Like, this Laguna is really pretty. This is one of my top Lagunas, I think. I don't remember my rankings at this point. I've done way too many, but I'm, like, 50% sure that she's hit my top. She's beautiful. I love her. Fourth place goes to Claudine, and this is one of my favorite Claudines for sure. She is stunning. I love her hair. Her face is really pretty here, and I really, really like this outfit. Claudine's fashion it never tends to be my favorite. Sometimes. Sometimes it is, but usually not. But this dress, I'm obsessed with. It's so good. I really like the shoes. Overall, she's just super, super beautiful here, which makes sense because she's kind of the main character of the movie, so she needs to be one of the best, but <laughs> irregardless, she's beautiful. In third place is Frankie. I love this Frankie. I like everything about this Frankie is beautiful. Her face, her makeup, her earrings are really cute. I love her hair. This dress is so good. I really, really like it. And the boots are beautiful. I also like the pants, or not pants, excuse me, the skirt. 
it's not like my absolute favorite thing in the world, but I'm willing to look overlook that with all of the other pieces. I do like the skirt. It's just not as good as the rest of the pieces of this doll, but she's beautiful. I adore this Frankie. Again, one of my favorite Frankies. Second place goes to Skeleta. I adore Skeleta. I think she's super, super beautiful. I love her hair. Her face is beautiful. The whole like skeleton doll thing hadn't really been a thing at this point that I know of. Her dress is really cute. I love her style overall. Like, honestly, she's really, really beautiful. And her shoes are adorable, too. But just the idea of Skeleta was so, like, brand new and cool that this doll just ranks higher for that reason alone. Not to mention she's absolutely beautiful. So Skeleta is definitely up there. And my favorite Scarus doll is the beautiful Genifier. I adore this doll so, so much. Like, she's stunning. I love, love, love her face. Her hair is beautiful. This dress is one of my favorite monster high dresses. Like, I adore this dress. I love her, con like, idea, her conception. <laughs> what am I trying to say? I love the idea of her, <laughs> and I love her shoes, too. Like, overall, this doll is just stunningly gorgeous. She's one of my favorites, and I really, really enjoy her. So, yeah. That's my ranking for the scariest dolls. <laughs> Let me know yours down below. Don't forget to like this video before you go, and subscribe so you don't miss out on any more of my future videos. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.